we're going to show you how to get rid of this, the five gallon jug of bleach for your pools. Yeah, that's what it is. You're pouring chlorine in, you're pouring bleach in your pool, that's what you're swimming in. And that's the way that you have to do it, or do you? There might be another way. Keep your pool safe, sanitize, give it free. Okay, so what we're looking at here is our chemical-free biosanitizer unit installed here out by the pump, also known as an ionizer. To install it, you basically come off of your pump here in this section of piping and you make a cut and you insert this T-shaped device here. The sanitizing chamber uh, basically is where the sanitizing rods exist. There's a copper and silver rod that comes down there as a wire coming out that plugs into the controller. And as the water is going through, when the pump is running, the uh, controller determines how much uh, needs to be uh, broadcast into the water to sanitize it. So that's how that functions. And those rods do get replaced about every year to two year. Put a wrench on there, unscrew it, pop a new one in, and take your cord and plug it back into your controller. But for installing, you just, uh, again, put it in line with your pump there. Bring your cable out of the rods and install it into the controller. Here's another shot of just how the system works. Again, putting it into the, uh, the piping coming from your pump in between there and your filter and up to the control unit that you're seeing here. There is a power unit that goes with it. We have it up here mounted underneath this uh, uh, electrical box to keep the you know weather off of it. And as you look, you'll see it is running and there's different... Uh, Note, notations there, solid blue is ionizing. If it's flashing, it means it's doing something. Everything is pretty clear to read. Right now, the plus signs there are showing that it's making ions. It's gonna be ending in about three minutes, and it runs four hours a day. Out of that, typically two hours, it produces ions. The only thing we need to do is put one of these three-inch pucks in about every seven to 10 days. Make sure you check your pool water for all of the, the proper balance, which this does a great job at. If it's a heavy rain, sometimes you will need to get some uh, pH balance, but basically this thing just works great. I really recommend it. Thanks for watching. We hope you look at uh, the alternatives that are out there for your pool, your chemicals, or not using chemicals. Consider getting rid of the five gallon bucket. There's no reason for it. There's a lot of safer methods out there. Do your research, make a choice that's right. We appreciate you watching. If you have questions or comments, Put them down below. Welcome everyone to my video. Thanks for watching.